Hello everyone, this is Aviator Jared here. We are now starting our stream. I welcome you to the stream. I hope you all will enjoy Hello, it today. Hello everyone, this is Aviator Jared Alright, so right here we have X Plane 11. Let's go ahead and start the new flights. Hmm, Alright, there it is. There's the 800X. Alright. Austrian Airlines. Alright, there it is, I believe. Yep, that's it. That is the airport. I'm gonna go ahead and spawn in here. I'm guessing we'll add some wetter here, Cirrus, I guessing, and this time. Got it loading in. Dang it, this buffering is, is killing my streams. We're waiting for the the thing to come on. Waiting, waiting, waiting. And since this flight is like almost, on, actually no, it's like only like an hour long, that means that it won't actually take too long. Long, which means that I probably won't go AFK for very long or I probably won't even go AFK at all. So that's pretty nice. So let me go ahead and check our routes on here. So the route is basically going to take us straight down, which is pretty nice. So this should be fun. Just waiting for it to load in. The Zebo sometimes takes a bit of time to load in, so don't worry. Millionaire, are you excited to be at your airport again today? Are you excited to be at your airport again today? 
minutes, so we're just waiting for it to load. It usually takes quite a bit of time to load in. But, hold on to your hats, is that we're almost there. Like, we will load very soon. Waiting, 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 waiting. I don't think X-Plane crashed. X-Plane did not crash. I can tell because it does not say X-Plane X system is not responding. It would say that if it would have crashed. Alright, finally it says done with preloading, which means that the loading is indeed continuing, which is good. Alright, so it should be done within about... Oh wait, never mind, it's already done. Alright, so we are spawned in. Here we have our nice, very beautiful Austrian Airlines Zebo 737-800. Looks very cool. 
Here we go. Let's go ahead and get some stuff. Like, let's actually go and get our pushback. Alright, so we better push back. Start push back. Copy that. Alright, we are. Let's go and enter. Copy that. And then here we can. I think we can actually see that. Yep, we can see that. It looks nice from the first officer view, captain view. Wing view, utter wing view, and autopilot panel view. Mm, here we have that right there. All right, we're almost ready for pushback. We're going to set some stuff into the autopilot. All right, let's go and set some stuff to the autopilot. We'll go for our earth speed for V2 speed. It's gonna be about. 165 and we'll go and set our altitude to 15,000 feet because we're not going to need the highest cruise altitude ever probably only about 28 29,000 feet today because of the fact that this is such a short flight all right we have 15,000 feet well so once we're at the runway we'll arm the auto throttle so we'll be armed so we can actually get the speed up there which is good Alright, there we go. We are connecting. Alright, copy that. Wait, wait, we do have engines started, but that makes sense. They sometimes say that. Alright, there we go. We have it right here. And then we're going to go and check our map. See, like, 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 where we need to taxi. So basically. So we basically, I, we, I think we are like pushed back like this. We're gonna be like pushed back over here. So then that means that we have to taxi around here, right out here. Yeah, that's how we are gonna taxi today. All right, so we are just casually doing our pushback procedure. This is a very nice delivery.
wonder why it's so laggy whenever I stream. Like, it shows it as laggy on my Chromebook, but whenever I'm, like, doing it on here, I have very good performance. That looks really nice. This is Austria for you. And here we have the pushback still going on very nicely. Go back to cockpit. Guess we have some stuff set. Hang on. Basically, runway heading is probably so. Like the heading that we're heading right now is about one zero. But we're actually gonna have to find that out once we are like you know stopped. The flight controls will go left, neutral, right, neutral, yep, same parking brake, back, neutral, forward, neutral, left rudder, right rudder, there we go, that's nice. Oh, heading 112, so I believe the heading of the runway, so that's about, like, and that's about that much. Like, actually, never mind. We'll just have to find that out once we're on the runway and done set heading. I will go and set our flaps. It's fine. Alright, you two, let's go ahead and wait for it um, to disconnect. I think he's doing that right now. Actually, he's already disconnected, but now he's like driving away either to that way or already that. Yep, I can see him. There he is. Alright, bye, man. We'll go and wait for his hand signal. he is and I think he's going to stop over there where we can actually see him so let's get back to normal view and look right and here we have him hello man and all right thank you I can see it right there let's go and release parking brake and taxi
different. We are taxiing out. I believe that's the way we wanted to taxi today. Yep, that is how we want to taxi. We're taxiing out there. And we'll turn right after this turn. All right, here comes our right turn over there. Oh, stop, 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 Where's... no, I think it just, I think it's just because that my joystick is very unresponsive with the rudder, oh no, 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 not what we want, that was very catastrophic, like, I don't know why this plane is so unresponsive now. I don't know if the 747 is like very uh, is very responsive, but I'm guessing in this simulator it's not very responsive. I'm going to pull back down on the first one. Set parking brake. I'm guessing we can like increase our power. No, 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 no. So you're going to go back into reverse for us now. This is a bit of bamboozled fight. No, 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 no. Dang it. This is a stupid joystick. Stupid joystick? I need mean, to be so freaking unresponsive. I hate this thing. Yeah, I hate whenever it's unresponsive. This is kind of neat why I need a, a, a type of like throttle. Oh no, we're heading the wrong way. This is be This is why I hate using this plane. Sometimes. Okay, I'm an idiot. I'm a freaking idiot because I do not know how to do anything. <laughs> okay, this is this is very stupid. I I don't know why this is has to why my flights have to be so freaking oh, catastrophic. No, no, no. I'm guessing we can taxi over here, maybe? Yeah, I hate whenever it's unresponsive. This is kind of neat why I need a, a, a type of, like, throttle. Oh, no, we're heading the wrong way. This is, this is why I hate using this plane. Sometimes. Okay, I'm an idiot. I'm a freaking idiot. Because I did not know how to get on. Yeah, because this thing wants to go into the freaking grass because it just hates its life. It just hates its life. This plane hates okay, its this life. Is, this is very stupid. I, I don't know why this is happening. Why my flight has to so freaking high school? On the way. Three, four, two, thousand, nine, hundred, three, remaining. We have to go over here. We have to backtrack. Short runway. Short runway. It's not a short runway. It's actually a very long runway. Oh, no, 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 no. We're tacking at a high speed. I mean, we could have taxied right here, but we can't. Hates 
So we have to get on to that area. We're backtracking over here. No, this thing is so unresponsive. Like, Rudder? Like, what is Rudder even doing? Is Rudder drunk or something? Is the Rudder drunk or something? Yeah, it must be drunk or something. We're taxiing too fast, too fast, too fast. Guess we have to taxi around like this, I guess. Like, I have no idea what this plane is doing, or whatever it's like doing. Like, I don't know why. Like, why do my flights have to be so freaking catastrophic? No, 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 no. This thing is stupid. Okay, I may need to send the sensitivity. Maybe even add, like, a nose wheel sensitivity or something. Like, because, like, this thing is so unsensitive. Like, it just wants to... I guess this thing is just cheap. It's like I they couldn't just get Frostmaster. This thing is so unresponsive. Like rudder like what is rudder Yeah, you guys can leave if you don't want to watch me being an idiot, because this thing is making me be an idiot. With this plane, my flights oh, have no, to. No, no, no. This thing is stupid. Okay, I may need to send the sensitivity. Like, even add, like, a nose wheel sensitivity or something. Like, I don't know why. Like, why do my flights have to be so freaking catastrophic? Because, like, this thing is so unsensitive. Like, it just wants to. I guess this thing is just cheap. It's like, I, I couldn't just get cross master. If you. Okay, that's it. I'm just going to cheat myself onto the runway. Who cares? Because, like, I'm not wasting my time just having to set control. Right, one, six. On runway, one, six. Yeah, I'm just cheating myself onto the runway at this point. Because, like, you know, who cares? I'm not taxiing. On runway, one, six. Alright, there. Now we can actually take off. There. Full power? Alright. There. Alright. Airspeed building. Eighty knots. Cross checked. V1 and rotate. On the brake, gear up. See, this is all my idioticness I had to have just to 
Alright, a right turn. We're going change our heading. Heading select mode where we have on the auto for all speed on. Set setting the speed to 200 knots. 200 knots selected. Alright, let's go and get the. Alright, let's go and go for command. No, 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 not that. Alright, this thing's gonna be idiotic. This thing better from. Alright, landing gear off. Alright, let's go for flight directors on. And we'll go ahead and go for... No, why? Why? Why does it... Oh, this be more... And, uh... Huh, this thing better stop. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Alright, I think the autopilot may be drunk or something as well. Is this autopilot drunk as well? Yeah, there we go, command mode. There we go. Now we can set our actual vertical speed. There we go, 2,500 feet per minute. Heading select mode, selected. Select heading 175. All right, there we go. Now this is actually working, finally. Finally, it actually wanted to work. All right, let's actually now, all right, so. Two thirty knots. Hey, right, that's nice. Okay, there we go. We're maintaining. All right, flaps two. All right, so we're just climbing at two thousand. Mm, wait, no. Why is this thing? Is this thing decreasing? Never mind. It's increasing now. And now we have a nice flight going on. There's the airport back there, I believe. That's it, right over there. Or you can't, you probably can't see it anymore. And we may be a bit far away from it now. And yeah, we are about eight. We're now nine miles. Of, we're nine miles away from it. Probably that's the airport. Yeah, that's the airport down there. And. Goodbye, goodbye Vienna. Goodbye Vienna. All right, let's go ahead and bring our flaps one. I'm gonna make sure of that. Make sure flaps one. And flaps up after takeoff check is complete. And then, so we have 230 knots indicated. Increase that to 50. And we'll hold that until we're above 10,000 feet. Maybe at 15,000, I'm not sure. Probably. Alright, let's go and set our altitude before we hit 10,000. Go ahead and set that to our final cruise altitude of about um, 29,000 feet. I, I, landing lights can come off. Alright, there we go, they're all off. 
I'm probably not gonna go for this flight unless if I have to eat lunch. But I'll have to eat that very quickly. Well, this is a nice flight ghost going on so far, so let's go ahead and set a wing view. Alright, set it to 50 and let's go for a wing view. Or maybe. There we go, and I'm gonna go. Oh, and I'll come back to check it in just a second, and then I'll be here for probably the rest of the flight. I'm not sure. So what does it say here on our autopilot? We have about 13,000 feet, looking nice on this climb. Go ahead and increase our speed to about 280. I believe that's going to be our cruise speed today because like, you know, like why not? We need that speed for our cruise. And hopefully this is going to be a nice relaxed flight. And we are obviously going to have enough fuel for this flight. We like, have a bunch of fuel inside this plane. So this should not be an issue. Alright, so we are about to pass through 15,000 feet. And... Oh. Oops. I gotta say, it's pretty nice. So this flight's looking good so far. We are already this much out from our, our departure. So oh, what can we see up here? LDVA. LDVA.
this one, so we're about to be a Quartia. Very nice. Looking pretty good so far. We should be there pretty soon. Hang on, let me go ahead and check some more stuff out. Okay, so, oh wow, we're actually going for the clouds. That's pretty cool. It looks pretty cool up here. Wow, all right, we're out of that cloud. That's pretty cool. All right, let's go and go back for a cockpit view, and we'll go ahead and change our heading a little bit. Zero. All right, so we're kind of changing our heading to actually head at the airport. Not me. This journey is about 283 miles, so we have already traveled around 40 miles, so we have about 240 miles to go. Pretty nice. This should be a fun flight to fly. change our view to wing view and but one last check is the altitude all right we have about 23 500 feet 23 500 that's pretty good all right i'm gonna go back to where we're at wing view and what can we see anyways uh these are some nice screens
Mm, checking our map. All right, this is looking good so far. And wow, I'm surprised on how much we've already actually flown. We've flown another 16 miles now, 17 miles. The last time I checked was like, we were like 40 miles out from the airport. So that's pretty nice. So we've hit our cruise altitude, 29,000 feet. Very nice. It's kind of a low cruise altitude, but that's because that this flight's not too long. So it kind of makes sense. Let's go ahead and go back to that wing view. Actually, we'll choose this wing view because it looks a bit better.
Set the mark to the mark 0 0.82. Nice. There's our airplane flying nicely. So right here we can see a lot actually. Now, what can we see over here? No one we're laying in is L D V R. Country that's kind of below oh, Bosnia, which is where we're heading at. Bosnia.
Let me check my, uh, you know, my map, so we can actually see quite a bit now. We've been flying for quite a while. And here's the report probably to our departure is that one, and that is already 110 miles away. Holy.
so we'll probably start to see some more once we are about, uh, I don't know, like, I think once this next thing appears, probably we'll know, like, how far away we are from our destination. The actual closest one is BLK, and that's about 55 miles away. Okay. I'll keep it on this view for now. Let's see how it's Sixty-five minutes into the stream. Nice. So we'll be right about thirty, twenty-five. Not sure how many minutes. Doesn't matter right now. Let's actually go for this view. This is a nice view. Okay, now I can see some more stuff, and well, I'm seeing quite a bit of stuff. This thing kind of looks like Bosnia a little bit. I'm not sure to which, if it is or not. Oh, what's this right here? Banja Luka Airport. Let's see what else do we have. Uh, hang on. Uh, we have down here in the valley. LQTZ. Wait, LQTZ? Now, how far away is that from Sarajevo? Tuzla Airport. It's in Bos- So we're basically, I think, in Bosnia now? Okay, now I can see some more stuff. And, well, I'm seeing quite a bit of stuff. This
back, so I believe right down here, I think, is gonna be Bosnia. Like, once we, like, get, like, you know, close enough. I guess this is the closest one to Bosnia. I mean, no, we're in Bosnia already. Obviously. Alright, so we're 40 miles from that, so probably at least 50 or 60 miles from the next point of scenery to be seen on the map. Not sure. Who knows? about a bit uh we have about 20 minutes till landing oh that is quite nice soon we should start to see our destination which is probably this place down here let's go ahead and see what is this place down here sorry j fuller space yep we're about 92 miles out there's 92 miles very nice Heading right at that, so let's go ahead and go to cockpit view and change our heading. We're going to change our heading course to about one five five. I'm going to heading one five zero. Oh. One five zero oh is good enough. Running three under twenty knots. Looking nice on this flight. right at Sarajevo right now, which means that soon we should start to see it like very far off
Okay, looking good. Video out. I can. I already know that we're about a few miles out. Quite a bit, actually. Yeah, now we're 80 miles out. Well, we look good. So we should probably start to send around 70 miles out because we still have like 29,000 feet to lose. Or maybe should we start now? I mean, maybe, probably. Yep, I'm gonna do it. All right, I'm gonna do it. All right, we're starting to send. All right, so we'll set our altitude to about uh, 10,000, 9,000 feet, probably 9,000. Because this is quite a short flight. I am sit around uh, 2,000 feet per minute, 2,500 feet per minute. And we'll bring back our speed to Mach 0.70. No, 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 no. Speed breaks. Okay, that's good. That's looking good. Looking really nice. We're now descending at a nice rate. So we're looking good. We have 28,000. Wow, we, I never realized that we were actually descending that quick, like that quickly. Wow. Right here's our descent happening right here. There's our airplane just descending. This, this model is very nice. It's the Zebo 737 and the Austrian Airlines slippery. That makes sense is that we actually departed out of an airport in Austria. It is Vienna. We departed out of Vienna. And we're gonna be landing. This flight is actually from real life. Someone from actually no, it was my friend who suggested it. He actually suggested it. All right now we have to hold around 280 knots. All right now we are below 27,000 feet. We've already descent around. All right, shut up, Master Caution sign. We don't need you, but we're not even. This is... All right, let's go ahead and make some announcements. All right. Probably try this again actually. Is there a tablet over there? Yeah, but. Okay, we go. That is being pulled out. So now let's go ahead and see this. Alright, we're 290 knots. Looking good. Pretty good on this approach. So, Jago. I, I can actually probably start to see more. Nah, never mind. We can't yet. Hang on, let me zoom in and see. Let me see a little bit of stuff. We have 65 miles. Pretty good. We're descending down to 9,000. We can probably bring up our vertical speed a little bit to like about 2,000 feet per minute. Oh. No, 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 not increase, decrease, yes. Sometimes I get confused for me. Alright, so now we can actually start to maintain. 0 0.60 not. Alright, this is a nice approach going on. Okay, now we're starting to lose our speed. Alright, 
there we go. The throttle has been cut a little bit. All right, that's looking good. All right, we have around 23,000 feet. We've gone up into the All right, look at that. Let's go and zoom into that engine. Wow. It says Austin.com on the side. Very nice. Like, I like how you can just zoom in into the texture and, like, never, like, no, like, never. It's like a never ending zoom. Now let's just zoom out of that. Well, here's our airplane. Looks really cool. Alright, there we go. We have more land actually appearing. And, well, yep, there's our airport. There's our airport over there. And, alright, so airport, 73 miles. Looks like that. Yep, it is 72.5 miles. We have about 72 miles. Let's actually kind of increase our altitude on the autopilot because we don't want to descend like too low. Right. I guess we can keep it at like 15,000. And we'll level off at that. There we go. That is nice. So we should hold 15,000 for a bit of time before we test the lights. Can, uh, this is like the best add-on plane for me. Like, imagine if we could actually use the manual gear handle if we actually had to use it. Like that would be actually kind of cool to use it though, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, you can actually use them, but we're not going to do that. Mm -mm, nope. We have an actual gear handle right here that's ordered. <coughs> Alright, so we have 277 knots. Sorry, right, so we're below 20,000 feet. Let's go ahead and bring that to 1500 feet per minute. Sorry. Alright, 1500 feet per minute. There we go. Alright, that's nice. Look at this wing view. Pretty cool. Position, this looks really nice. We are below 19,000 feet. Which is good. There's OQSA. So now we are now. Now we are 62 miles away. So I think the approach we're going to do is that we're going to kind of like come out. Like, you know, like once we're a bit closer to the airport, I believe. I'm actually just gonna come in and then turn left and then land. No, kind of like that. It's kind of easy approach. No, this is actually gonna be kind of as well difficult as well because the, that at this place we have a lot of terrain. I believe we actually have quite a bit of terrain at this place. By terrain, I mean it. Like just like look, there's terrain over here, terrain over here, terrain everywhere. It's quite a bit. Okay. 
So I think the approach we're going to do is that we're going to kind of like come out, like, you know, like once we're a bit closer to your father, I'll actually just kind of come in. Zero point five zero max set, and I guess we can bring it back up a little bit. Never mind, it's actually working. We brought it back to zero point five zero max. Now we are actually. We should probably just set it to. Mm. Wait, I know. <laughs> hey, that's actually nice. All right, so now we want to be at like at least two fifty now. Bring it up the gear handle so that it can actually come down. Once we press the gear handle, and then the gear will go down. All right, we're closing in. There's 50 miles. Are you looking pretty good? Yeah, we are a total of 49 miles out. Oh, looking good. Looking pretty nice on this approach. Maybe we can just come straight in, but we will have to indeed avoid this terrain. No, I'm like. We'll have to come in like this, turn like that, and then come in. Alright, the approach is going to be quite simple. Alright, it's going to be quite fun. I'm going to maintain 250, and I'm as well going to keep maintaining 15,000. knots looking nice 44 miles 45 from as well. this is the runway we're gonna be landing on I don't know what runway we're landing on but like all right 44 miles away 
Because I guess at least 10 minutes. Forty miles. So we have forty miles. Right, there we go. We can actually start to see our plane on the map as well because that means that we're close to the airport. I think I'm actually going to kind of be in this approach procedure. I'm going to start a bit of a right turn. Heading 170. Yeah, 170. There we go. Turning right at 170. 153, 154, 155, 156, 57, 158, 159. And when there's one six zero, we are now starting to stop turning. And then maybe after this turn, like after maybe like a minute or two, we'll start descending more. Because we are quite close and quite high as well. So we should. We can actually start to see our plane on the map as well because that means that we're close to the airport. Well, I think I'm actually going to kind of be in this approach procedure. I'm going to start a bit of a right turn. Alright, let's actually go ahead and start more of a descent. We'll go ahead and descend down to 8,000 feet and 7,500 maybe. Yes, yeah, 7,500. Alright, let's we'll send out a thousand feet per minute. That's just confirm. And we'll bring the speed back to 230. 230, yes.
We've been, we've been in the air for an hour and three minutes, which is nice. Here's our approach going on. We'll go and sit uh, our first notch of flaps. We'll go flaps one. Maybe as well, maybe more than that because two flaps two. Right, and select and vertical speed mode is still selected. We're descending to 2. By the way, you can talk and I will hear you instead of comment. Reply to me. Okay. But just to let you know, I don't think this stream is usually in real time. Because, like, usually, like, it's a bit delayed, like, by about 10 seconds, 20 seconds. So, sorry about that if I don't respond very quickly. That's why I kind of have to comment. So I'm sorry about that. All right, so airport is to the left, I believe. Yes, it's 26 miles out. I think this is Sarajevo we can kind of see because that's where we're like you know heading for I think I'll go and check our altitude uh 12,000 feet hang on my elevation at this place All right, let's go ahead and turn. Let's go ahead. And, all right, my heading. All right, I have controlled my heading. I've controlled my heading. So now let's go. Ahead. All right, I'm going to turn left. I think this is Sarajevo. We can kind of see because that's where we're like you know heading for. All right, and uh, well, I guess my aircraft. All right, my aircraft. Hang on. Hang on. All right, this is my aircraft, my throttle. All right, so we'll go flaps five degrees. All right, this so we're coming into land. Go ahead and All right, so we're on final approach, runway, runway one two, or maybe one way, uh, runway three zero. Uh, well, I guess my aircraft. Uh, my aircraft. All right, so the altitude may actually be twelve thousand feet MSL, which means that it's not our altitude, like our, it's like our altitude above sea level, but like. You know. What is the elevation of Sarajevo? Here is some information for Jade Plant Height. According to Clemson Extension, Clemson No, is no, not that. Alright, so we're on final approach. 1,804 feet. Uh oh. 
Uh, the elevation of this place is around 1,804 feet, so we are probably like 11,000 feet right now, 10,000 feet. Depends on like. And like, I believe that maybe the airport down there in that valley up ahead, or maybe up ahead, I'm not sure. Yep, I could see the airport. Airport in sight, so I could see the pat base. I know it's going to be good descent. Flaps 10 degrees. The elevation of this place is around 1,804 feet, so we are probably like 11,000 feet right now, 10,000 feet. Depends on like. Right, set auto throttle thing, you know, auto throttle's not even on. We'll set it down to about 170 knots. Like, I believe that maybe the airport down there in that valley up ahead, or maybe up ahead, I'm not sure. Yep, I can see the airport. Airport in sight, so I can see the pat base. Alright, so we need to start a bit of a right turn, and we have to follow through here. Sar Man, Sarajevo actually looks quite nice down here. Like, the airport is not the biggest airport. Alright, we'll go gear down. Alright. Alright, so we need to start a bit of a right. Turn. Right, and there we have free green. Man, Sarajevo actually looks quite nice down here. The airport is not the biggest airport. We're coming in to land. We got some more flaps out. We got below 10,000. We got landing lights on. Alright, the rio it's on. Now let's go ahead and start more of a descent. We're actually around eight thousand feet right now. Alright, we're about eight thousand feet right now. Oh, no, 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 don't go up, don't go up. We don't want you to go up right now. We want you to go down. Because we need to get lower so that we can actually land at that airport down there. So we have about a bit more altitude to lose, but this should be a nice landing. Alright, the <laughs> Alright, so our speed is good. Gonna bring back that power as well on here. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't go up, don't go up. We don't want you to go up right now. We want you to go down. Because we need to get lower so that we can actually land at that airport down there. We have about a bit more altitude to lose, but this would be nice. Mm, I, this is looking good. I've never landed at this airport before. Actually, I have done it in a different flight simulator, but but not but not this one. I've only taken off from this one. I will go ahead and unarm the auto throttle so it doesn't go back on again. Alright. Alright, go away. Alright, there we go. We got a nice approach going on. We are 8,300 feet, which is about... Like 7,800 or maybe 6,000 feet, something like that. 
looking good, looking pretty nice. We are descending at a, quite a rate, but that makes sense. We need to actually kind of descend a bit that fast due to the fact that we have to land like pretty fast and pretty soon. I've never landed at this airport before. Actually, I had done it in a different flight simulator, but, but, not, but not this one. I've only taken off from this one. It doesn't go back and forth. Alright, let's go until our flight. So. Is that that? I we have pretty good lineup, but like we're still pretty high. You know what does the pappy say? Alright, four white, we're still pretty tight. Alright, we brought some more flaps out. Looking good, looking pretty good. Yeah, I think we have full flaps out. Yes, we do, we have full flaps. Right, looking good. Looking pretty good. We have 140 knots. So let's go and set our view to about 140. Hi, we have a pretty good lineup, but like we're still pretty high. So what does the Pappy say? Like four white high so far. Alright, sorry everyone if this is a bad landing. I mean the approach is kinda of bad, not really. We're still pretty high, but like, let's go ahead and bring the nose down. We need to descend at a rate. Right, sorry, everyone, if this is a bad landing. I mean, the approach is kind of bad, not really. Right, this approach is required, kind of, because of our heights. You should probably use more speed brakes. Yeah, the speed brakes are helping as well. They help us slow down. I I think. Hang on, how far out are we? Hey, we are lined up with the runway, clearing. All right, we are cleared to land. We're six point two. We're six miles out. Twenty five hundred feet checked. Use more speed brakes. Yeah, the speed brakes are helping. As well as they help us slow down. Alright, speed brakes off. And we are lined up with the runway, clearing I'm your clear to land. Alright. Guys, enjoy the rival. Hundred feet right now, looking good. All right, I think we should soon get like one red already. All right, we have still four whites. But wow, this place is pretty beautiful.
Alright, there we go. One thousand feet. Alright, tricks. Alright, I should probably get some scenery for this place at some point. Not sure. Alright, we still have four white, but that's probably a lie. That's probably not right. We we look pretty nice on glide slope, even though we uh, have four whites. Plus we're eight hundred feet at this point. I think this is how you're supposed to land at this airport. This is my friend. This is one of my friends' airport. Alright, there we go. 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 I'm literally trying to land a plane and you're probably gonna make me crash. Ash, if you have to make me he read chat. Alright, we're on glide slope. Alright, we're a little fast. 148 knots, real. Mind, we are not fast anymore. Looking good. I ain't looking good. No, don't float. Don't float. A little, a little of a late landing. Come on, don't float. Don't float too much. And we are down. Boom. All right, pretty nice. All right, spoilers. Reverse screen. D cell. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to to Sarjevo. Welcome to Sarjevo. Okay, we kind of missed that exit right, a little bit. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Welcome to Sarjevo. Welcome to Sarjevo. Alright, soon. Alright, bring everything to zero. That's the most we can go on. Hang on, let me go for autopilot view and so I could set everything. Go. go. Oh, 
have a view and so I can set everything. Go. Hi, this is the exit we're gonna take. We're gonna take this exit over here, this exit. And we're taking this exit. One hundred remaining. Alright, we're cleaning up this airplane. Alright, no, 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 not this again. Not this again. Where are we? Where are we literally going to the grass? Because this thing has to be freaking unresponsive. And this plane is very unresponsive whenever it comes to this. On oh, turn. Why isn't this thing turn quick enough? Exit. Oh no 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 no! Dang it! Okay, uh, this no, is no, just no, really. Not this again. Not this again. Where are we? Where are we literally going to the grass? Because this thing has to be freaking unresponsive. And this plane is very unresponsive. All right, now there we go. All right, this is actually kind of working. Not really. Or not, or not, or not. Come on. Dang it. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 no. Dang it. Okay, this is just really... We're doing a nice quick taxi. And well, this is nice. Alright, this is actually kind of working. Not really. Or not, or not, or not. Dang it. Ooh. This is our gates. I mean, maybe not. Or maybe I should just. I swear, if this thing is stopped, this thing better stop being unresponsive or else I will have to destroy this joystick because it must be making my whole entire flight unresponsive. I mean, maybe this. Never mind, I'm just gonna cheat myself into position with the gates. Alright, this is good enough. Alright, let's go and clear up the airplane. And we'll get our... We get, we'll, we'll go ahead and cut the power. We'll go ahead and get our... Never we'll, mind, I'm just going to change myself into position with the gates. Alright. 
I can cut the engine power. And, whoop. There we go. We are. Alright, there we go. The plane has stopped. Now let's go ahead and go for replay. Right, right, replay. So it was an hour and three minutes. And we'll get our. We'll get. We'll, we'll go ahead and cut the power. We'll go ahead and. That's quite a nice landing. A late landing butt. Boom. Oh, that was very nice. And well, let's go and see that from a different perspective. Right, let's go and see it from this perspective. Make sure where we are at is a good position. Yep, that's a good position. Go for it. Keyboard on accident with my leg. Oops. View, which was nice my view. Keyboard on accident with my leg. Oops. No, we can't really see that, but boom. And actually, yeah, there's actually another view. Sure. Alright, let's go ahead and show this view. Ooh, nice. 
nice. There we go. That looked really nice. you guys enjoyed let's just go ahead and close X plane all right it's doing that currently there we go and now we can end the stream all right I'll go ahead and end it Let's go ahead and, and I will see you again next time. And well, bye. Yep, there's two hours and five.